Now here you'll see we have one, two, three, four, five identical GoPro Hero 4 Black Edition camera set up. They're already turned on and the combo cables are plugged in. However, the combo cables from the USB point of view are not plugged into anything. They are all the same at the moment. This. These are all the official GoPro cables, including the extra USB cables. Each camera, okay, that's not plugged into anything. And this one, this uses a Lindy cable. This Lindy cable costs seven pounds. It's a very high quality cable. Each camera, each camera is currently plugged in to a Rode VideoMic Pro, all identical setups. And I'm going to start recording on each camera now. Some of them have their sound, the beeps turned off from productions we've worked on. Now, what you're now hearing through each camera, and I'm going to come down to the cameras. I say, you are camera number one, you are camera number two, you are camera number three, you are camera number four, and you are camera number five. Now, currently, the audio is plugged into every one of these cameras. However, the power is not. So what I'm going to do now is go through, here on camera number one, we have a USB battery and via its cable, we'll plug you in. Okay. And then <coughs> here for our second camera, we have an Orky battery pack. USB battery pack. Now this is the kind of thing we would use to power these cameras in a car. You can see the blue lights have come on. So the audio you're hearing now, as I cut between each camera, you're hearing the audio from that camera. So here we are, camera number three. Um, this one is also, just as a, as a balance, going to be plugged into an Orky. Blue lights are on. Now number three, I'm going to cut back to this camera to show you here. This is an Orico uh, special little unit that you can plug into um, a car port. Here it's running from a 12 volt adapter under the desk. But this is the kind of thing also you may use in a car to provide 5 volt power via USB. So this camera is going to be plugged in. Take this away. Here is our official GoPro lead, which I'm now going to plug into one of the universal sockets. I'm going to stand that little way. Now I'm plugging that into one of the universal sockets here, and then into the power socket. So that should give you some idea on this camera. And then this on. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. I guess our fifth and final camera. I'm going to take a very long cable, and this I'm going to plug into. In fact, I'm going to drag this camera around so you can see it for yourself. This one I'm going to plug into a Mac Pro. Right here. You know that power is coming from a Mac Pro. Now, I have another type of battery here. This is an EC technology battery, very good quality. The one that I plugged in there, I'm going to disconnect. That should be you. And I'm going to plug in. There. So that's now plugged in via the EC technology. So, to run through again, we have camera number one which is plugged in via this battery. We have camera number two, which is plugged in via the Orky battery. We have camera number three, which is plugged in via the EC Tech battery. We have camera number four, which is plugged in via this little Orico. And we have camera number five, which is plugged in to the Mac Mini. Now, sure, I'm sure you can hear this audio distortion problem on one or more cameras. So I'm gonna go back through, cut through to the cameras. Go, this is camera one. This is camera two. This is camera three. 
this is camera four, and this is camera five. And again, to cut back to my main camera, so you can see that setup. And you can watch as I now disconnect each camera. So, camera number one, here comes camera number two, camera number three, camera number four, and camera number five. That's our test.